that the deficit on the current account of the balance of payments for February came in at only 9.52 billion rand. That in that month we had exported 62.3 billion rand and imported 71.8 billion. Now we were relieved because the month before that, in January, the deficit had come in at 24.5 billion. What these figures underscore is that this country has been running a massive deficit on the current account of the balance of payments, meaning, quite simply, that we're importing a great deal more than we export. That's the objective reality that we find ourselves in. The second thing is that we are confronting a reality which I think has been underscored by the discussions we had uh, at the BRICS summit, among others, that there is a major repositioning of our trade that is taking place and needs to continue uh, to take place. Whether we like it or not, and it's a fact of life, along with the fact that it's raining outside, uh, the major trading partner that we have had historically in this country, the countries of the European Union, are in fact a market that is not growing. Uh, the latest uh, crisis in Cyprus is just underscoring the fact that the European Union continues to be enmeshed in a, in a, in a, in a crisis which every commentator tells us is going to last for some time. In the case of Germany only, has our trade last year recovered to the level that it reached in 2008. In all other countries in the European Union, our trade remains below the levels it reached in 2008. Now, by contrast, our trade with other developing countries, with the African continent as our first priority, but our trade with other dynamic developing and emerging economies has grown rapidly. What is pretty obvious to us is that we need to increase our exports, and in particular, we need to increase our exports of value-added products. That's the objective challenge that stands before us. This program is a program which is designed to assist and prepare exporters uh, to become more active in international trade. What this program is intended to do is it's intended to try to bring about an agreed standard set of interventions to support improved export readiness uh, of uh, our companies uh, in South Africa. There are five components uh, of this uh, National Export Development Program. Uh, they start off with uh, cultivating an export culture in South Africa uh, through a national outreach program to develop awareness about the importance of exporting. Uh, they are, include uh, the provision of national trade information services and advice uh, underpinned by an export help desk, an export portal, and a trade-led management system. The third pillar is extensive capacity building supported by a structured me me mentorship mechanism uh, through the Global Export Passport Initiative. So you'll have some consistent uh, and compatible across the country recognition of where you stand uh, in that uh, uh, arrow that moves up uh, towards becoming a global exporter. There will be the special projects that uh, Pumla mentioned, such as export villages, uh, to encourage uh, collective efforts by um, much smaller producers. And then there will be a leadership and stakeholder me engagement mechanism uh, to drive a successful implementation of the uh, NEDP through a much more powerful uh, export community uh, law, uh, voice.